Hey guys, I'm here with my full day of eating today. I hope you guys enjoy watching this video. For each food or meal I have today, I'm going to be putting the macros up on top of the screen. And I'll also be putting my Fitness Pal pictures screenshots on there so you can see the exact macros and the full thing for the day. So I am back from class. I'm going to go ahead and get started with my lunch and then show you what happens the rest of the day. I forgot to record my breakfast, so I had a egg white omelet with string cheese, and I had oatmeal with two tablespoons of peanut butter. I also wanted to take a second to talk about IIFYM, if it fits your macros, or flexible dieting. I know you guys saw my grocery haul earlier this week, and it had candy bars, and it had chocolate, and it had a lot of peanut butter and just stuff that people wouldn't normally eat on a diet or for healthy eating, eating clean, whatever. But I just wanted to reiterate that I eat 90% clean every day. I just fit these fun foods, these chocolate sweets into my diet because I can. If it fits your macros, allows you to have your favorite foods, your craving foods, just in smaller portions or in moderation so you don't go crazy while dieting. I don't even like calling it dieting. I just like it a meal plan or just daily lifestyle, how I eat, how I live, whatever. But if you guys want to know about this IIFYM flexible dieting, I'm starting online training in a couple weeks. Look out for it on my Instagram. I'll be putting it in my video to let you know. And yeah, I just wanted to let you know, I don't eat chocolate all day long. I also eat chicken, all that other healthy stuff like veggies because I enjoy it and it tastes good. It fills me up, makes me feel good. Lunch is going to be four ounces of grilled chicken with two servings of veggies. I didn't get a chance to vlog in between classes and I had a cheese stick and a protein bar. Macros aren't on this cheese stick, I'll put them on the screen. And my protein bar has 12 grams of fat, 14 grams of carbs, and 10 grams of protein. For dinner, I'm gonna make ground turkey chili with 93% lean ground turkey. And I have some chili powder, and I'm also gonna add a little bit of barbecue and some extra spicy Mrs. Dash. So for my ground turkey chili, I also added pasta sauce and a little bit of noodles, and I'm gonna add some cheese. For dessert tonight, I'm gonna have cereal with a protein shake as my cereal or milk. So I'm gonna have one serving of Reese's Puffs. It's gonna be 29 grams. We have 22 grams of carbs, two protein, three grams of fat. So I'll zero this out, put it on grams. Have 29 grams in a serving. Put a little bit back. So you have 29 grams. I made a chocolate whey protein shake. Gonna put that on top. Oh my gosh, this looks so good. So excited. So it's like a chocolate shake with cereal. Okay, so I think I finally have decided what I want to do for my giveaways. It's going to be mid-October for the giveaway, and one of my giveaways is going to be one free online training with macros, so someone will get a free training um, coaching online from me. And then my second one are going to be goodies. The goodies are going to be, I'm going to have one of my favorite peanut butters. I'm going to give away a pre-workout energy energy, energy, amino energy drink. Then I'm gonna have protein and the quest bar. I think I might put a couple other things together for that, but we'll see, see how many people apply. 
You need to be subscribed to my channel to be eligible to win. That's all free giveaway. And then I'll let you guys know who wins mid-October. So tell your friends or maybe you don't. Just apply or subscribe. And then I'm going to have a hat and then pull two names out for online training and my free giveaway. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Good morning. So today I am doing my update with my weight and my measurements and I am going to check that and maybe make adjustments this week based on where I'm at because we're over halfway and I want to speed things up just a little bit just for the end of my uh, cut here. So let's get started. Okay, so here's where I'm at. Here's where I'm at in my flex. Okay, so I just took all my measurements, and as you can see, I have all the same measurements as last week. So that is actually good feedback because that can help me gauge where I want to go for the next few weeks and I'm planning on cutting back just a little bit on my calories which will change my macros so once I get those figured out later today I'll let you know and one thing that I could change is the amount of cardio I'm doing but with my schedule and time availability I don't have the time to do more cardio and also I figured out that it just makes me hungrier so it just screws up my macros in the long run so if I adjust my macros just maintain my current workout plan, I'll see changes from that. So that's why I want to change those macros and I'll let you guys know how they are later today. And that'll help me speed up the process. So I'll see you guys next week and let you know how things go.